Hey, you guys. I hope everybody's had a wonderful day. Welcome to Asian I Think Yes. I pre-ordered my Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 5 and it came in early. I'm so excited. So I wanted to open it with you guys and let's see what's inside. I cannot wait. I've got my Galaxy Z Flip 4 so we can do a little bit of comparisons here and there so you can kind of see what the differences are and what the changes are. Let's open this. Oh, it actually has little nice tabs on it. I love opening new technology. It's always so exciting. Here we go. Ready? Bam. Oh my gosh. It's so beautiful. Look at that. I did get the purple one. If you can't tell already, my favorite color is purple. Here we go. Let's rip off that sticker. Oh, you guys, it is stunning. Okay, so out of the box, if you pull this tab, it does have the papers for everything for the phone. There's a little SIM popper in here. I accidentally just pushed it down in there. Um, and that's right there. And then you also have your charging cable that comes with it. Unfortunately, these don't come with charging blocks, which really, it does bug me. I wish that they did. It's not the biggest deal. They haven't done it in years, so I'm not surprised that they didn't go backwards. Look at that. I love it. I will say I do kind of like the purple better from last year. It's a more of a, a dark, deep purple, whereas this one's kind of a pink, but that's okay. It's still gorgeous. Okay. So first thing we've got the Z Flip 4 on the right and the Z Flip 5 on the left. We do have our a uh, fingerprint scanner that's built into the power button. It does look a little bit smaller, but I mean, they work absolutely fantastic. I love it. We've got the volume up and down here. And then we also have the USB-C charging go in the bottom. It does charge up to 25 watts at its highest speed, or you can also use the wireless charger if you prefer. I do that as well. Um, but the biggest difference is going to be the back, which is going to have the front facing screen is a 3.4 inch, which is bigger than last year, which is the 1.9. Um, and I think it's going to be so much easier to use. I'm really hoping it's going to help with the screen protector issue. You can see my screen protector has come up and I had the Z Flip 3 and now I have the Z Flip 4 and it's just been a continual issue. I'm really, really hoping that this year it'll get a little bit better. And hopefully they've improved that. This bigger screen, since you can use it more though, hopefully it'll prevent me from having to open it as much. Um, so that way it won't happen. And it's it's more a me thing. Um, it doesn't actually hurt the screen. It works perfectly fine. I, I just don't like looking at it. It just bugs me. Um, but so the nice thing about this new front screen is you can do texting. You can use a lot of different applications, um, including social media. Um, it does come with a limited amount of applications you can use on the front, but if you want, you can actually go to, um, Samsung's applications and they have a uh, application. I believe it is called good luck and you can, it'll, you can download that and use that to be able to use all applications for the most part on the front screen, which is pretty nice. The other major difference is going to be the hinge. It's pretty easy to spot. This is the four. This is the five. You can see there's a big gap in the four, which honestly never really bothered me, but maybe it'll help with the screen as well. I'm not sure since there's less of a gap. I, I don't know if that's going to help or affect it at all or not, but you can see it's a lot more seamless in the new, in the new five. So let's power this bad boy on and see how it looks. I haven't turned it on yet. So here we go. I bet when you turn it on, something, a picture will come up for the top too. Yep. Something comes up for the top. Oh, look at that picture. It looks so good. And it has that super satisfying close where if you're just upset and you want to hang up on somebody, I love it. That's my favorite part about the Z Flip 5 phone. Other than the fact that it just fits in your pocket, which is why I got the flip in the first place. Because girls just, we just don't get pockets, ladies. And I don't know why. So um, first thing when you turn it on, of course, it'll have your welcome screen. Um, I'd really just wanted to show you the display and what it looked like. Um, the display for the knits is a smidge different this year. We do have a little bit of an upgrade. Um, on the inside, it is seven, 1,750 nits, and the top screen is 1,600 nits. So the, um, the brightest peak display is a little bit brighter this year. And we also got a storage upgrade. So the lowest storage model that you can get is a 256 gig. 
Um, and last year it was 128 and you can actually get a free upgrade this year if you pre-order um, by August 10th in the evening um, at midnight, I believe. So if you're interested and you still wanted to get that pre-order deal so and get a free Thank you guys for joining me today. I hope um, you enjoyed the video. Upgrade, then you I know this isn't could. my typical kind of content, um, so if you yeah. are interested, feel free to check out my other videos. They are typically more centered around um, mystery toy unboxings and other kind of game and toy entertainment unboxings. But if you want more information, feel free to check it out below. Otherwise, have a good night. Bye, guys.